Teachers are beginning to regain access to activities. Those in Evansville and Vanderbilt County lost another one today. The County Commission and Evansville Parks and Recreation Department announced today pools will not open for the 2020 season. Eyewitness News Miranda Meister is live in Evansville with more on this. Miranda? Shelly, this means the summer swim program won't happen this year. The officials I spoke with say this was a hard decision to make, but a necessary one. As Parks Director, hardest decision that I've been a part of? Empty pools won't be filled this year. That means the sounds of kids splashing and having fun at public pools won't be heard. Summer swim teams won't be practicing, and Tuesday nights will be a lot quieter with no swim meets. The myriad and, and ripple effect of, of the situation we find ourselves in uh, currently. The Vanderbilt County Commission and the Evansville Park and Recreations Department decided local pools remain closed for the 2020 season. I mean, this is solely based on the pandemic. The coronavirus pandemic already forced the opening date for pools back to July. That caused city and county officials to look at how they would handle the reopening. During this COVID-19 uh, situation, it became apparent and absolutely clear that we could not enforce distancing at the pool. But beyond social distancing, masks are supposed to be worn in public, but swimming with a mask on might not be safe. So they worried about people having to enforce these rules. It's unfair to our employees to be tasked with enforcing something that's almost impossible in a swimming pool situation. And making sure there were enough lifeguards on staff was posing another problem as programs that offer recertification aren't open currently. They say they know this has been a hard year for everyone and taking this away was something they didn't want to do. Brian Holtz with the Park and Recreations Department tells me they are coming up with ideas to make sure that people can still get out in their neighborhood and enjoy the things that the Parks Department has to offer. He says more information on that is to come, but he recommends that people take advantage of the youth sports leagues that are still available, like Little League. Reporting live in Evansville, Miranda Meister, Eyewitness News.